everybody, it's your boy Titan the Feet Jack, and I'm back at you again with another video. I'd like to welcome you guys back to the channel. Before we get started, I need a couple of things from you. I need you to hit that like button on this video. Let's run them likes up. Also, I need you to drop a comment in the comment section. Let me know your thoughts on the sneaker we're looking at today and today's video. And if you haven't already, sub up to the channel and do hit that notification bell so you know every time I upload content on this channel. Now today we got a little early review for you guys. Today is Tuesday and I'm hearing rumors that it's gonna be EA on uh, Sneakers app. Sneakers app is giving EA on this sneaker. So when I say that, you guys should already know what sneaker we about to look at today. Let's take a look at the box. You see the box. Shout out to that boy Bird. Bird hooked me up with these Bird Kicks. You see a, a nice smooth seal color box. You got that great jaw jump man flight on it. So you guys that uh that tag. I'm gonna read it out to you. It says Air Jordan 4 Retro SP. SP stands for special projects. And the colorway is sail, white, pine, green, and these are side fitting B nods. And you see that Nike Air, I'm sorry, that Nike SB, which is a Nike skateboard and Jordan. This is a collab. Take off the top. Uh, no lap stamp in the top. You're gonna look at the paper. You see, you got that splatter paper. Smooth on one side, rough on the other. Look further into the box. You do have your green and white YCM sticker. And that pretty much is everything that comes in the box. So without further ado, let's get into the shoe. Yes, guys, here's an on the foot look at the Nike SB Air Jar Retro Full Pie Green. Oh, uh, Nice comfortable fit, good looking shoe, nice quality materials. I don't know, let me know what you think guys. You got the SB on the back. Pretty good looking shoe, comfy. Give y'all another look around once again. Yeah, look at that SB on the back. Here we go guys, we have the Nike SB Air Jordan Retro 4. Let me know your thoughts on this sneaker on first uh, look at it. Uh, looking at it for me, it's an amazing sneaker. Great quality materials. That's what you pay the uh, $225 for. These are gonna be $225 retail. They are set to release. Exclusive access today. Today is Tuesday at the time of recording this video. Tuesday, March 14th. You know, the holiday for us gentlemen. And they're all going to release in skate shops, I believe, on March the 17th. And I think the regular uh, release on the sneakers app is going to be March the 21st. A lot of dates to remember. So if you didn't catch it, after you finish watching the video, replay so you can catch those dates. Now let's get into this sneaker. This sneaker is made on an all-sale base. You got some nice premium leather on here. Going up on here, you got your uh, your mesh system right here and sail color with white uh, sail behind it. You got your uh, sail color wing extenders with the uh, green or uh, pine green molded eyelets right here and there. You do have a little gray on the uh, mud guard and it's a nice uh, Nice little shawl grain the swig right here. And you do have that pine green on your midsole to introduce the pine green to us on that midsole. You got that white going around your air housing, clear bubble. You have a red inside and you do have that hit of bubble gum at the heel and a toe. So we're gonna go to the outsole of the sneaker. You got that herringbone traction right here in white. You got a red Nike uh, logo right there and you can see that bubblegum heel and toe action here. And mm, here we go with the back tab. Instead of saying Nike Air or the Jumpman logo in Air, 
it says Nike SB Air. This is a Nike SB and Air Jordan full collab. This is the first time they have collab on this sneaker. However, they have collab together before in the past for Jordan, a couple of Jordan ones, the uh, LA to Chicago and another one. I know it was gray and you can rub the uh, color off and it's another color that lies underneath. And you got that uh, on here on the white pine green and look how flabby this is normally it's not like this on force but they wanted to make it a little more comfortable for skateboarders because sb is for skateboarders me myself i don't skateboard i leave that up to you guys i respect what you do it's not for the kid so they got this so it'd be a little more comfortable and we're gonna go around to the medial side of the sneaker we have more of that uh, premium leather on here in the sale colorway, sale wing extenders, and your pine green molded eyelet right here. You got your sale mesh system right here with sale behind it, and you have the pine green on your midsole, and followed by white going around your air housing, clear bubble with the red inside, and you can see that hit of bubble gum at the heel and the toe. And take a good look at the toe box as we speak of it. You can see the uh, suede. It kind of reminds me of a sneaker that, uh, who of that thought? But looking at the toe box, leather is pretty good. And you got your net, uh, going all the way up to here. And you do have one set of laces in here, the flat sail laces. This is the only set of laces that these came with. And you do have a woven patch sail color. Red John jumped me up here, flight in pine green. And uh, the leather is so soft. And we're gonna look at behind the tongue, pine green. And you do have a sail color sock liner. It's more like that fuzzy sock material. And inside we do have tissue. And here's a look at the insert. It's red, Nike SB Air branding, size of sticker, side fitting, B Nords. Uh, and we do have a dream cell uh, insert. I go up a size in my uh, Jordan 4s because uh, they tend to run a little snug. So for the sizing fit, I recommend going up because that's how uh, they fit snug on me. So that's why I go up. Some people may like the snug fit. So if you like that snug fit, you can get your true size. But... I strongly recommend going up a size or half a size because the only reason I go up a full size, size 14 and a half is not available for me in Jordan. So that's why I go to the uh, size 15. And your size and tag, it reads. Give you a look at that. You got US size 15, production date June 22nd to October 26th. So almost uh, four months of production with these. Let me know if you're going to be going for these. I hope you've been entering your raffles online, checking your skate shops and all that good stuff. Uh, and then I hope you got EA today because they issued it out today. Again, today's Tuesday and I'm recording this video. But uh, if you don't get the EA, hopefully you can hit on your skate shop raffles, which is on the 17th. If you don't hit there, hopefully you can get them on the uh, 21st of the month on the sneakers. That, that'll be your second chance. But this is the sneaker. Let me know your uh, thoughts in the comment section. And I'm going to wrap this video up. Like I always tell you guys, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker. Because you never know, but it will be your turn to need help getting a sneaker. I'm Titanic Feed Jack, signing out.